Hi, I'm John Vicente, Capital Projects Manager for the City of Shoreline's Aurora Corridor Improvement Project. The project is transforming three miles of Aurora Avenue North running through Shoreline by enhancing vehicle and pedestrian safety, improving traffic flow, and increasing transit capacity. Another important element of the project is the capturing, storing, and treatment of stormwater runoff. Stormwater runoff contains sediments and pollutants that can cause harm to our waterways. The conventional way of treating stormwater runoff is to direct it into storm drains and then store it in catch basins. However, this method eventually releases untreated water into our natural systems. The city has used a number of innovative techniques along Aurora to naturally slow down and filter stormwater runoff before it reaches salmon-bearing streams and the Puget Sound. In addition to using rain gardens, permeable sidewalks, bioretention boxes, ecology embankments, and vault and manhole filters, the city has also used two new technologies in the middle mile of Aurora. The first new technology used are silva cells by the Deep Root Company. Silva cells allow larger urban trees to grow in amenity zones without damaging sidewalks. Silva cells are placed underneath sections of sidewalk and concrete pavers are placed on top. Rain percolates around the concrete pavers into the silva cells to the trees. The trees' roots will grow into the silva cells. The end result is a well-fed and happy tree that will grow larger in the urban environment. The second new product installed is called a Filterra stormwater system. Filterra boxes remove heavy metals, oil, nutrients, and suspended solids in the water so that the water that goes into the city's stormwater system will be cleaner and better for the environment. Another significant stormwater feature is the rain plaza located at the park and ride lot at North 192nd Street. About three feet below the rain plaza is an array of four large detention pipes. Stormwater flows from the street, plaza, and the park and ride lot to these pipes where it is stored and slowly released. Slowly releasing the water reduces flooding and erosion in the downstream waters of Echo Lake, Lake Ballinger, and McClear Creek. The City of Shoreline is proud to be at the forefront of using innovative stormwater management technologies in its capital projects, helping make Shoreline a truly sustainable community. <laughs>